Hey everyone, this is Good Money Stewart coming at you. I am throwing together some leftovers and I thought, you know what? I'm going to record this. It's some roast beef I had left over. Um, had some vegetables I needed to get rid of. And so I'm just making this up as I go along. So I've got it in my crock pot here. And you know what? It's, the light is not all that cool in here, but... As you can see, I've got broccoli. I've got, no, you can't see. I've got broccoli. I've got, let's see if we can get this. You know what? I better just leave it as it is. Ah, oh, not a messed up, guys. I've got broccoli. I've got carrots, um, onion, garlic that I've got mixed in here. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to take my roast that I've chopped up and I'm just gonna dump that over in there I dropped some on the floor so now I know my little doll's gonna come in here because she can smell food can't let her eat too much because her little tummy is not the best so better hurry and get that up but um okay so I got that in there and like I said I'm just let me throw this in it I don't want to get y'all seeing me on camera <laughs> I'm not kidding. I look a hot mess. Let me just... I'll get that later. Okay, so now what I'm going to do, I also have some... Hold on. I've got cabbage and simply cooking with uh, LaTanya. I'm finally using this broccoli, but what I'm going to do... Broccoli. Oh, what are these called? <laughs> oh my God, I can't. That's something how I'll just go blank. But uh, you know what? Brussels sprouts. So I'm going to put those over there with the cabbage. So I'm just going to dump this, guys. I'm just going to dump it. Everything is a dump. It's a dump soup. That's what we're going to call it. It's just a plain old dump soup. But I'm mixing stuff up in here I've never done before. I'm going to take a can of... Of these Dollar Tree organic diced red dice fire roasted tomatoes and I'm gonna drop those over in here okay then I'm gonna take this prego tomato basils a vegetable classic soup I'm gonna dump that in there I know it's kind of dark. Jeez. I'm going to get my act together with that uh, camera. I did put it on my uh, tripod tonight, kind of messing around with it. I know this sounds, this is a lot of red I'm putting in here. And then this is, oh, I had another light. Hold on. Maybe that'll help us some. Then I'm going to take this picante, uh, paste picante sauce and I'm going to dump that in there and one last drop I'm going to put in here I need to get my spoon out because I need to stir this so what I'm going to use this I'm going to kind of mix it up in here a little bit I just thought I said you know I got these leftovers and I'm not one that believes in throwing food away no, I see too many people going hungry. And then to have food, you're going to throw away. That's crazy. And then the kids have the nerve to tell me, well, I don't want to eat. No, it don't work like that. When we were kids and our dad went out and worked hard, him and my mom, and my mom cooked something, and we had the nerve to say, I'm not eating that. My dad would say, okay, then take your butt to bed. And when you get hungry, your plate will be sitting here when you're ready. My dad did not play. He, you know, they came from uh, a really poor family, and uh, it was all about, uh, you eat your food. <laughs> you eat your food. Okay, and then this is uh, about two cups of chicken bouillon. So, I have, the ch I have the actual chicken broth, but you know what? Sometimes I use that in this. So, I'm going to pour this in here. And I'm going to let this cook overnight. 
I'm going to start it off on high and then I'm going to check on it. I'm not going to put any seasoning in it yet because those tomatoes have quite a bit of seasoning in them. Then the chicken bouillons, they have quite a bit. So I'm going to start this on high and then uh, I'll check it later. But today was my procedure. Everything went well. They did find some polyps. So they are uh, looking at those uh, to uh, check those out. And then they told me I had something else. Boy, I can't think of the name of it. But it had to do with me eating more fiber. Like they told me I need to uh, take Metamucil, uh, stay away from popcorn, stuff like that. And so, which is fine. You know, I like popcorn, but I'm not addicted to it. So, this is just a uh, time for me to do some changing with my eating. And I'm going to try to eat more green vegetables, drink a whole lot of water, and do my walking. Do my walking. But I will not put myself where I just make myself miserable. I know I need to lose weight. Nobody has to tell me that. I'm chunky. I'm a big girl, but I need to lose weight. So that went well today. And my friend, the lady at my church, I think she's gone to every procedure I've ever had. Uh, as my mother started getting older, she couldn't do it. So I always like someone to be with me because I can't drive. And Mary Barker, a shout out to you because you know what? You're awesome. I thank you. You were a blessing. It's just like your sister to me. Um, she's from Barbados. Barbados, Barbado. That's where she's from. So she was there with me through the whole thing. Brought me home. I lay down for a while, but I couldn't sleep. And now I'm getting so sleepy. And my stomach wants to start bothering me. But you know what? I'm not going to let that happen. I'm just praying over my stomach and everything. Uh Articulitis. Articulitis, I think they said that's what it was. But anyway, I just got to watch what I eat. But this is what I wanted to share with you guys tonight. I'm going to let it start cooking. Again, I just chopped up some onion, bell pepper, garlic. Then I did my cabbage, the Brussels sprouts. Took some uh, roast that I had left over. I poured in some preg uh, prego tomato basil soup. Love it. And then I took, which came from the Dollar Tree, this Organic Hunts Dice Fire Roasted Tomatoes, which came from the Dollar Tree. Took this Paste Picante Sauce, which came from the Dollar Tree. Dumped that all over in there. Um, I think it's going to be good. You know, I'm not bragging, but I make pretty good soups. And it's just for me dumping stuff. It's not from a recipe or anything. I just dump. You know, some people say, well, and I never remember. I've got to start writing stuff down. But I wanted to share that with you guys, let you know that I'm doing okay. Everything turned out good. They still got to give me the report of those polyps. But I'm just believing that nothing's wrong. I'm fine because I've prayed about it, and I'm not going to get all crazy about it. I'm just thankful that I was able to go get it out of the way because I was putting it off and putting it off. You know how we do, but it's best we just go ahead and do what we need to do. So this is Good Money Stored. It's Monday night. I got to get ready for work in the morning. But if you like these videos, thumbs up. Don't like them, thumbs down. But by all means, please subscribe to my channel by hitting that button below. And when you do, every time I do a video, you will be made known of it. And yes, this is a thrifty crock pot and I got it so dirt cheap the only thing that was missing was the little thing the little handle on it but hey you know I'll take a knife let me show you what I do you know how I do I take this knife I push that thing up and it's up so hey I'm I can work it but anyway have a wonderful wonderful blessed Monday night and the rest of your week may it just go smoothly father I thank you for all my subscribers I thank you that they're blessed I pray that this week be a good week for them. I lift up those that are having uh, bad weather. And I just cover them under the blood of Jesus. And I pray blessings on their household, on their families. I lift up those that have asked for prayer regarding families and friends and cousins and just situations in their life, Lord. 
I thank you that you love them enough to hear their cry and answer their prayer. So, Father, signing off in your son Jesus' name. Good night, everybody. This is Good Money Stewart.